once you convert construction to algorithmic terms, if you model construction as elements that are constrained by physics, and each of those elements needs some tasks and resources to be built, it turns out that buildings and bridges and tunnels and hospitals and skyscrapers are really kind of the same. They're elements that are constrained by physics that need resources and tasks to get built. It actually caught me by surprise at how little tweaking it needed. And 98% of the solution is the same across all of the stuff.